Hey there YouTube, what's up, what's up, this is The Void here, um, I'm just giving you guys a quick little update to my account, uh, before I do Dual 25, um, I know I haven't been posting in a while, I just started a new job, I've been really, really busy with that, I've been, I've been doing a lot of Skyping with, with some, uh, with some big names from the forums, because, I mean, I feel like I'm pretty good, but I can always get better. So I'm I've been skyping with with Pox Equestria, Nelly Nell, and Gores from the forums, um, and they've been teaching me quite a bit. So, um, but I I am going to be getting back into the swing of things. I'm going to put up a deck a day. Um, I'm going to be recording a lot. I'm pro I might do um, some voiceovers only because it will be easier for me to record and then voiceover. Um, because I'm going to be busy for the next week or so. I'm going to try and record and do live uh, before tomorrow night when I start to get busy. If not, I'll be busy until not this Monday, but next Monday. So I might just record and then do voiceovers whenever I can. But I will get a, I will get a video up every day. Um, if I can't get it up I will I'll get up I'll get up to the next day um but that would, that would only be if, if I'm sick or something so so that's just a little update um I'll also give you an update of DN because there there have been things that changed um in the in the duel actually so I don't think that, that there's really anything else to say so enjoy Duel 25, the last duel with my with my anti meta gadgets. And no, this is not the 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 new dominating DN gadgets. This is still the anti meta build. I still play the oppression and whatnot. I do have another another gadget deck set up, and, and hopefully I can play with with this ban list. Can't promise you anything though. So see you soon, YouTube. Hey there, YouTube. What's up? What's up? This is the Void here with Duel 25. And there have been a lot of changes to DN. Um, the first one you can see is the cards now can have back coverings. It's actually pretty cool. Um, so judging by, by my opening hand, this is going to be a really quick game. Because I can swarm extremely fast now. Um, I'm searching for green right here. So. Fortunately, I'm, also gonna, I'm still going to lag like a beast. I don't know why I'm so laggy. But now it's going to lag even more because there's been a lot of server stress and people are, go are lagging like crazy. So, I'm just going to go ahead and set, uh, I'm going to set all three ultimate offerings only because there's a good chance of him destroying at least one with maybe a MST or something. I mean, what's the scenario he's going to true nade? That'd be the only thing that stops my OTK next turn. So, I might, I might not even OTK anyway. Um, so, but the other major thing is that gadgets have become really good on DN because now, oh my freaking god, I hate, I hate Six Samurai. I just gotten really good on DN because we now have exceeds or XYZs, whatever you want to call them. Which is just truly, truly awesome. I'm gonna mess with him so bad if he tries to go into um Xi'an. Um or not, because he has a dark hole. Asshole. Actually I can still mess with him. Yeah, I guess you see, uh, she in. <sighs> fun times. I hate six samurai so much. So I'm gonna draw two. What is it? Red. Okay, you guys see three. That makes me boy. Alright, so I'm now really high. I'm at, I'm at uh, eleven sixteen. I've been playing a really dominating uh, deck. Let's double check this thing really fast. Okay, it's not a big deal. This is why I said all three of them because I can the ultimate offering still. I might do it on his turn. Let's go right in the riser. You know what I'm going to. Eh. Nah, well, whatever. I'm just thinking about it. I'm not going to. Um, but I am going to swarm the field and just really, really hurt him next turn. And I draw into a forbidden land, which is always good. So I'm gonna go ultimate offerings. He's probably going to negate. And 
that, that that's exactly what I thought he was gonna do. And I'm just going to go ultimate offerings again. But first, I'm going to summon the green gadget. for red. I'm not gonna summon red yet. I'm gonna wait with the red. Um now this is still my anti meta gadgets only because I only played two of each gadget instead of three. Like like new meta gadgets. Um just because I don't I don't want to have to deal with the um I don't want to have to deal with um, changing my deck for one game because that's kind of like like a betrayal to you guys. So I'm gonna go Mobius first. Pop his back row. That's probably the better play because I'm, I'm gonna try and I'm gonna, I'm gonna clear his field to the best uh, to the best of my ability. What the hell is this too? That's. I can't change that, it's a counter trap. That sucks. But oh well. Um what I'm gonna do I know I know I know what I'm gonna do. It's gonna hurt me a lot. I'm gonna pay the five hundred. Really hoping that this video isn't more than twelve minutes. So my five minutes. Okay, that's fine. Um switch up for yellow. I have three of each one. That sucks. I hate that. Tribute off for Ryza. I'm, I'm gonna target this thing right here, this back row, because I can take out Sheehan with the Forbidden Lance in my hand. So I'm gonna I'm gonna spin his back row. That that'll keep him really from drawing anything. Um. So I'm just going to go ahead and summon all three gadgets instead of doing it over and over and search and shuffle and search and shuffle. Uh, where is green? I have to do green first. There's green. Why can't I grab green? Freaking slow as hell. There's green. And here is red. Yeah, slow as hell. I hate that lag so much. Now I'm going to... God damn, this lag so much. I'm going to, uh, to XYZ summon for the Kokora Mori Dragon or something like that. Uh, it's, it's one that, like, you can attack something and then if you kill it, uh, you can detach an XYZ to attack again. And if he has a mirror force, I'm gonna be really upset. And he has a deep prison. Okay, I kind of figured that that they had something. It's not a big deal. I just have to freaking detach everything. It's so irritating. So unfortunately, he will survive the turn, which means I did overextend. But so did he. He gets that one trap that I returned to the top of his deck. It's no big deal. So I'm going to attack in with the Ryza. He was obviously expecting the Forbidden Lance or the, or a Shrink or 
Book of Moon, there's something to get this thing to the point where I can kill it. That like so I'm sorry that I like so much guys. I really wish I didn't. So down goes so down goes his she and so he's gonna take seven hundred and then uh, and then another fourteen hundred from the gadget. So at this point we're down the top decking. I have the better field because I actually have a field, and this is where it gets interesting. This is may the best luck win. So I'm gonna draw. With Dark Hole, yeah, that's gonna do me a lot. I'm just going to attack in. And he's just gonna take it all to the face. And if he doesn't pop into anything, I will get game next turn. Ooh, hoo hoo, that, that's pretty bad. He's gonna, he's gonna get out another sheet and, okay. That's bad. And he has and he's a Kaizen, of course he's a Kaizen. Oh what a pro. Fuck. He might he might have the game though, because that, that that's that's really upsetting. Um so hundred. Let's see if I drew into uh Kaius or Ariza, this wouldn't have been a problem. Um, so at this point, unless I can draw into a pot of avarice, draw a monarch, well, a, a Ryza and a gadget, um, or just a Ryza and an anything, as long as it's a gadget, or as, as long as I can summon it. Oh, that was volume control. At least he's uh, honest. So thank you, Shadow Shadowfall, for being honest. But If I draw the pot of avarice and he allow and he doesn't allow it, then I can I can I can wipe the field. Pot of duality. Ooh hoo hoo. I'm actually, I'm actually surprised that they negated that, um, because what can I really get out of it? It's a spirit or something. Well, I'm just gonna blow up your field, so, goodbye. And once again, we're back to the top decking wars. So I think I'm, I'm at a monster that can summon it for Reapers. Oh yeah, that, that's gonna do something for me. Let's just set it anyway. And he got it. Okay, so that is a good game. I sent 14-11 now, it's like it's 2 and 3. Um, so that is a good game, Shadow Follow 1. Um, the question is going to be... What do you feel is going to be the most dominating deck between TCG and, and OCG um, with with XYZs being out? I, I would have the same from personal experience. I have found Dark World to be extremely dominating. So, oh my god, it's over 15 minutes. That sucks. So, um, so what do you find to be the most dominating deck? Rate, comment, subscribe, and see you soon, YouTube.